Hello, welcome to your magic trick. Today it's going to be a trick you need. Show me a bit. You need two decks of cards, two people, and um, oh, the two people is you and your spectator, and they have to be pretty good at cards. Now, here's the performance. Them. Yes, we'll shuffle the cards each by four packs. Yeah, nice try. Okay, so Let's now do, uh, I have a shuffle in case the other one won't go. Okay, now. Are you, are you happy with your shuffle? Yeah. Now we're going to swap decks and put them in three piles. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we just drop them in three piles. We'll look at our own middle pile. Yeah, middle pile. Okay, so now. Oh yeah, show the camera yours. I'm not in the way. Tell me when you're done. Yep, done. Right now we're gonna have you put it back on top? Put it back on top now. Um okay, so now just collect them up. Now we're going to swap decks again. And now you look for your card that was on here yeah. in that deck, and I'll look for my card in this deck. Okay, so I've got my card. Tell me when you've got yours. I'm not going to touch the it's rest a big of the deck. deck. It's hard. Mm. I found it. Okay, so just put that face down on the table. Okay, are you sure that's the right one? Yep. Yeah. Now, what was that card? The Two of Spades. That was Spectator's card. And what was my card? It was the Two of Spades as well. Yes. Pretty amazed at that, aren't you? No. Why? That's a magic trick. Okay, thanks for your help. Um, I'm sure the spectators are amazed. Yes, I am actually. I was only joking about. Yeah. Um, it's a pretty big coincidence that we've got the same card, isn't it? After all that shuffling. But there is a secret. And I am going to teach you how to do it. I'll need you to reveal the secret so you will find out how to do it as well. <sighs> okay, so when you shuffle them, we. Okay, you're shuffling me right now anyway. Do your shuffle and take a sneak peek at the bottom card. Three of hearts. And then they'll do their shuffle. Oh yeah, I just messed it up. Anyway, take a sneak peek at the bottom card. In this case is the King of Spades. This one is No, the... you don't need to know because you're the spectator. You wouldn't <laughs> do that. But the magician, you need to look at the bottom card. Then when you swap decks, uh, you just put them in the three piles. And you've got to look. That's where the bottom card is. Let's see the King of Spades. Oh look, you haven't got it on camera. The King of Spades is on this pile. Moving forward a bit. Okay, so you've got to watch where they put the bottom card. So it's at the bottom of this pile. That one, that one, that one. Okay, so now when you do that, they'll look at the. Doesn't matter what yours is. Let's say it's the Seven of Hearts, but it doesn't matter. Theirs does matter. Theirs is the Queen of Diamonds. Okay? 
So you tell them to memorise it, then put the bottom card, pick it up in this order. Bottom card goes on top of the... This is what they're doing. You tell them to pick it up this way. Because they've got this the deck with the bottom card at the moment. Anyway, so you've got the bottom card on top of their card. And then you can just put the rest of the deck on top of the pile that doesn't matter then you can just collect them up in any order because this deck doesn't matter at the moment then when you swap back okay put it in sight okay so when you swap back uh, you tell them to look for their card in your deck but then so if you look for your card in there and I will look for the bottom card, which is the King of Spades. So as soon as I find the King of Spades, which is right about I found it. what the King of Spades or your card. Oh yeah, you didn't look at one, did you? Yeah, I actually saw that. Okay, so look, we found the King of Spades, the bottom card. So above the King of Spades, you go back a space, and there's their card. Not your card, your card didn't matter. So they're obviously going to find their card, which is this card. You're going to find their card, which is this card, by memorising what the bottom card was. Then you pretend that was your card. No, it wasn't. It was the Queen of Diamonds I showed them. No, it wasn't. It was, Taya. It was the Queen of Diamonds. It was, actually. It was eight. Oh, well. It wasn't. You know. You. You know. Oh that it was uh, the Queen of Diamonds. But anyway. So as soon as you found your bottom card, go back a space, there's their card. They will pick out their card, which was Queen of Diamonds as well, which you now know. They'll put it there, pretend that's the Queen of Diamonds. She didn't look properly. So then... They'll turn over theirs, pretend it's Queen Diamonds, and then you'll turn over yours and say, we got the same, what a coincidence. It might have confused you then because my helper didn't really help. Sorry. And she didn't look at a card. I looked at it. It's just kind of my fault as well. I didn't tell her that we were looking at it. But I hope you got that all right. If you didn't, you might have to watch it again, just skip it to, again, 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 skip it to the tutorial. That's basically it. Hope you liked it. That's called the do as I do trick. And uh, thanks for watching and goodbye.